YouTubers, today we're going to make this fun Batman themed chocolate banana cream pie. I'm going to show you how to paint pie crust so you can add cool decorations to any of your pies. As always, look for the things that you need in the description box. Let's go ahead and get started. To make our pie crust cutouts, you're going to need some ready-made pie crusts, a variety of different food colors, some small letter cookie cutters, then you're going to want to get a conversation cutter. This is something I already had, uh, kind of looks like an explosion. You can also just use a round cookie cutter, or there's also some conversation cookie cutters that you can get. A paintbrush, and to make the Batman cutout, you're going to need a stencil of the Batman logo. To start our cutouts, I unrolled my pie crust and I put it in the refrigerator until it's nice and cool. That'll make your cutouts come out cleaner. So now I'm going to start with my cookie cutters here and we're just going to go ahead and start cutting them out. I've got all my cookie cutouts done. I've got my conversation pieces and then all the words that I'm going to use like pow, zap, bam, etc. You can use whatever word you want. Now it's time to do the Batman logo. If you have a Batman cookie cutter, that would make this a whole lot easier. But if you don't, print yourself out a template and then I'm just going to use a small sharp knife to cut around my template. I've got my Batman logo cut out. Now I'm going to put all my cutouts in the refrigerator for about 15 minutes and let them cool down. To paint our pieces, I've got a little bit of an egg wash here, which is just my egg mixed with a little bit of milk. And I'm going to take my paintbrush and I'm going to paint on a thin layer of my egg wash onto one of my pieces here. On this plate, I put a little bit of my gel food coloring. Now we're just going to paint it on right over our egg wash. The egg wash will help thin out your gel food coloring. I've got all my pieces colored and put on a parchment lined tray. Now I'm going to carefully cover them with some parchment paper and we'll put them in the refrigerator until time to bake them. While our pie crust cutouts are chilling, it's time to make our pie. I've got a pre-baked pie crust and I chopped up a banana and we're just going to layer our banana at the bottom of our crust. In this bowl, I microwaved a little bit of hot fudge, and we're just going to drizzle that over our bananas. I'm going to pop this in the refrigerator, and we're going to make some vanilla pudding. I'm going to whip up the vanilla pudding per the instructions on the box, but I'm going to add some yellow food coloring for the background for our black Batman logo. I've got my pudding whipped up, and now I'm just going to pour that over my bananas and hot fudge. Now I'll wrap this in plastic wrap and put it in the refrigerator to set. We're about ready to bake our pie crust cutouts. First we'll go ahead and bake our Batman logo. I've got it on a baking sheet lined with parchment paper. Now I'm going to take another piece of parchment paper and lay over the top of it. And I'm going to take this pan that I have. It's just a 9 by 13 metal cake pan and place gently on top. The weight of the pan will help keep the shape of our Batman logo. I'm going to pop this in a 400 degree oven and I bake it for 7 to 10 minutes until it's lightly golden brown on the bottom. You want to keep checking it. We don't want to over bake this. To put our conversation cutouts together, I've got my egg wash here and my conversation piece and the saying that I'm going to put on it I'm going to take a little bit of egg wash on my paintbrush again and we're just going to cover our conversation piece and then carefully we're going to put our saying on. That's what we're going to do for each of our conversation pieces. Let me finish those up and then we'll be ready to put them in the oven. We're ready to pop them in the oven and we're going to do them the same way we did our Batman logo. I'm going to cover them with a piece of parchment paper and carefully set my pan on top of them. 
We'll pop these in the 400 degree oven for probably six to seven minutes, just until they're golden brown. Finally, to put our pie together, I'm gonna take my Batman logo and I'm gonna place it right in the middle of my pie. We're ready to put on our conversation pieces. And to do that, I have a can of pre-made buttercream frosting. And we'll just take some of that and put it onto the back of one of our conversation pieces. And then we'll just use that as glue and we'll stick it onto our pie crust. And there you have our Batman chocolate banana cream pie. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please join our channel. We hope to see you back soon.